Over the years, I've probably seen several hundred of these 336 extractors that are torn all to hell and bent because people don't know how to take them apart and put them on. If you'll notice in the bottom where the locking collar is, the two tabs where it ends. To take the extractor off without damaging it, lock it in a smooth jaw of ice, and then take a rubber band and make about four wraps around the extractor and the bolt nose. Then take a, a pair of common needle nose pliers, rest them on the ends of the collar, and give it a short swat with your hand. And the extractor will pop right out. And it won't go flying across the room. Not bent, not scratched, not damaged. To put it back in, lay it in the groove, and then just press it down with your thumb and it's back in. It's that easy.